Hello everyone. Today, um, as you can see, I'm in still in my PJs, and if I put my hood up, it's even cuter. Oh yeah. <laughs> but whatever. Now let's get to the video. So I decided today not to do an animal thing, but to do some stretching, maybe, because like I just need to stretch too. So. I'll probably talk about animals while we stretch. So I've seen a lot of things where people go into handstands and, they're and they touch their heads and it's crazy and I can do it too. But sometimes they're not that good in the first try. At least I'm in a onesie so I <laughs> it'll be fine. I don't know if this is a good angle. Right, go lower. Hopefully this works. For you guys to see me. Okay, here I go. Oh, that was so close. But I can't touch my head. So, a way you can practice that is... We're going to want to find an empty wall. I have one right here. I have a wall. Right here, I'm in my parents' bedroom. So, yeah. That's why the setting kind of looks different. And what you're going to want to do is do a handstand onto the wall, like this. And then you're going to want to slowly work your feet, like kind of um, close to your head. Move your hands more the way and your feet kind of closer. I know it's kind of hard. For you guys to see me, so I'm going to switch the angle. Hopefully this works, I don't know. So here, you're going to can you try arching your back, and that will definitely help. So um, before you guys all start doing that, I am going to do a back stretch with you guys. So I have some really good stretches. My first stretch I recommend is so you're gonna get down. Let me put this down. You're gonna get down on your stomach and kind of like this. Put your arms here and then you're gonna sit up like this. This stretches your back a lot too and then that's not good enough for you. You're going to want to put your legs up. Try to touch your head. And even try to touch your head to your butt. It's a really good stretch. I think you guys should try it. And another good stretch is it's almost the same thing, but you're going to grab your legs and just go up like that. Some people call it rocking horse or like boat something whatever like that i just decided to do a little stretch for like the first part of my video kind of so let's get to the animal the animal today is gonna be oh wait before i tell you the animal i have something to tell so what happened to my channel i figured out so my comments were permanently turned off if i get any other further note notice i will tell you guys but i know in the last video i said to comment down below what animal i should do don't do it guys it doesn't really work so yeah i just decided to tell you that so my animal today is power monkeys I know a lot of people think, like, monkeys, like, trees, and, yeah, stuff like that. And, yes, you're right. They do, most monkeys do live in trees. And howler monkeys, with their name, they ha howl. And it can be heard from really far away. Like, if it was, like, all, so I live in a house that's right by woods. And if you, like look down outside of my window 
there's a bunch of trees and if I were in a place that a monkey would live that howler monkey would live um you would probably hear it definitely from inside your house and like you could depends how close it would be like if it's really close you could definitely definitely hear it like but if it's like a little farther away it kind of depends on where you are in your house so like me if i was right here i could hear it probably if it was like if there's a monkey out there howling i'm in my mom and dad's bedroom and they have a door with curtains on it that leads to our deck which is really cool so yeah i just i just decided to add that little stretch in because i felt like it and it's a good thing to do in the morning so definitely recommended and monkeys and apes a lot of people think they're like the same thing they're not monkeys are have tails actually and apes do not i just said decided to put in that fun little thing in there i don't know what i'm doing so yeah i just heard my doorbell ring <laughs> i don't know if you guys can hear it because it's like a ring doorbell so it's kind of quieter and you can hear it from out there my mom's talking to my grandma that lives in a different country so yeah if you hear her that's what it is so i think i'm gonna have to say goodbye to you guys and i will see you on the next video goodbye yeah. i don't know what i'm doing